most Thank most you. beautiful things come at a cost. Yeah. Absolutely. I don't worry, we'll handle it. Okay. We'll find a way around it. Yeah? Yeah. It's like 90% completed almost. So. Ah, I'd say 80. Yeah? Yeah, so. Mom, good morning. Good morning, Mama. Both of you are the most stupid set of people I have ever seen. A man whose house is on fire does not go chess and what? Get it? Your house is on a serious fire that is likely to consume you if care is not taken. Why are you here eating, enjoying yourself with your wife when you are supposed to be out there looking for a solution to your problem? Why? But, wait. We're just having a moment over fruit. W what's wrong with that? Open that to your cursed mouth and say one more word and I will pour this on you. Ah, uh, Mama, that's enough. Idiot. Mama, you're going too far now. What? Mom, sweetheart, it's okay. Mom, you are going too far. Respect me, mother, for I am still king. I am here. You can see me. Son, I am doing what I'm doing because you are the king. Don't you know that you might lose this throne that God gave to us? Eh? Has it occurred to you? Now listen. If I ever see any of you Eating in this house again. Both of you will be ready to bury me. Give me that. Come on, give me. Houses. Stupid. Foolish people. Honey. I know. Calm down. I'm here. It's okay. Trust me to take care of this. Calm down. Easy, baby. It's fine. Take it easy. Breathe. I'll handle it. I'll... Uzondo, I don't like what, the way you are behaving these days. Eh? When I ask you for financial assistance, eh? what is wrong with you? Uh, uh, what is wrong with me? Can you feel me? Brother, what have I done? Brother, what have I done? I asked you for financial assistance to solve a pressing problem. And you tell me I want to buy jam foam for my daughter. Of course. Jam foam for my daughter is not important. What I want to do with the money I have is very important. For my only child, Amarachi, my daughter, it's so precious to me. In fact, it's all I have. So I must do the best I can for her. I'm not sure you're in a job. I'm not sure you're in a job. That's what I'm saying. I'm not sure you're in a job. I'm not sure you're in a job. Why are you always talking about Amarachi as if uh, 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 there is something else? Eh? A girl child for that matter. Eh? Someone that can die tomorrow. No. Ba, 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 stop that. Brother, can Kamsi can die tomorrow? Uh, are you wishing her dead? Hogan is it? Why are you always sounding negative about my daughter? Do you want to kill her by yourself? Ba, it was really like a people who were going to die for me. Hi, brother, Bano. I have told you, that is all. Just to be careful. So that you will not cry, had I known, had I known, a one year million of a guy. I'm no, got it. Okoro, that was what happened that very day. Mm. 
Ibogwe has a lot to tell us concerning the disappearance of my daughter. If you want to go, I call on a call I go I go let him open his mouth and talk. Yes. Thank you very much, uh, Uzandu. <clears throat> Ibokwe, you have heard what your younger brother Uzandu said. Now tell us, what do you have to say about this? What sort of stupid accusation is that? <laughs> eh? What sort of insult is this? I am... Look, how dare you? How dare you? Anyway, just because I decided to come to this meeting in this is useless house, eh? how can he accuse me of having anything to do with the disappearance of the daughter? That is useless daughter. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Stop calling my daughter a useless child. Stop it. And if I do? Try it again. Eh, woman, just hold it there. Are you okay? Don't you ever try to insult my husband here. Yes. I will deal with you, man. And your husband must not insult anybody here. Ah, please. Enough of that. Enough of that nonsense. Enough of that. Of that, of that, of that. Of that. Why are you people are giving each other in my present? Hey, excuse me. Excuse you what? Did I insult anyone here? Ask yourself that question. Did I? And for your information, you can never do anything to me. Hey! You can never. Look at this yellow witch. His eyes like a witch. How dare you speak to my father like that? Are you mad? 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 Seriously, I don't understand my mother anymore. My king, what do you really mean? Oh no. Mm -hmm. What kind of question is that? We have been talking for quite some time now. Are you telling me that you've not been listening to me all this time? No. I've been listening. I've been hearing you very clearly. But... I never knew you would take it to this dimension. What dimension, Ono? What are you insinuating? That the king of Enyato Kingdom has been in marriage for five solid years without a child is more than enough reason for his mother to go to the extreme that she has gone. Any other woman in her shoes would have done the same. My king, your mother loves you. She loves you. Your mother wants her grandchildren. Hmm. I know I understand how she feels. That is not enough for her to go as far as she has come. She needs to remember that I am king. My king, she knows. She knows very well you are the king. But don't forget, you are her son. My king, your mother thinks you and your wife are not doing anything concerning your situation. That is wrong. Then, prove her wrong. Oh no. My king. My wife and I will have a child at God's own time, oh no. We'll keep waiting on God. At his own time, we will have a child. We are doing something. We're doing all that we can. We have gone for all kinds of checkup and we are medically okay. 
Then keep praying for your mother to understand you. Because I don't see it happening. My king, don't forget the tradition of our land. What the tradition says. Oh no. On whose side are you? On the side of the truth, of course. Papa, Mama, I honestly do not like what happened today at the meeting. Hmm? I feel so ashamed that my own family engaged in a physical fight to Uncle Ozondo and his wife. Hey? A fight we could have prevented from happening from the onset. Why shut up your mouth? What's your mouth? Must you open that stupid thing? That's got that you come at all the time to say rubbish. Must you? A goldie. A goldie, I've said it before. You have to explain to me where you got this idiot from. Because I can possibly not further this kind of lunatic. Papa, calling me names or trying to shut me up. Do not stop me from talking, no. Please shut up your mouth. What is wrong with you? How dare you open that thing you can't go to, to say this rubbish you just said now? How dare you? Mama, it's better you slap me the more. Uh, people... ah, if you talk again, I will slap you. Because I will not stop saying the truth. What people are doing to Uncle Ruth and drive is wrong. Ah. Uh -huh. no, she's still talking. Come, 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 come. Hey, would you want? It's as if you don't have sense, Abi. It's as if you don't have brain. That stupidity you think you have in your body, I will beat it out of you in this house. Now let it be the very last time you will open your smelling mouth and speak to Mama and Papa in that manner. I regret ever having you as a child, if only you came from my uh, 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 loins. Eh? But Nani, Nani, please, please don't just say that one. Eh? Don't you know that you are insulting me by saying that? Eh? I'm yet to confirm it because I don't see how I can be responsible for that lunatic. Look at this girl. Can you imagine? What has come over her? Mama, you need to slap her again. Slap Mama, her that mouth. slap is very cool. Omera, oh, 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 if you, you say any any change change again, my marriage has gradually turned into a nightmare. What is the problem this time? My mother-in-law. My mother-in-law, who used to be very caring, gentle and, and lovely, has changed completely. What did you do to her? What else is the problem other than the fact that I'm yet to give her a grandchild? You don't really have to blame her. I know. But it's not my fault. There's nothing wrong with me. All the doctors my husband and I have visited have repeated the same thing. They keep saying that we're fine. But my mother-in-law doesn't want to hear that. She's always breathing down my neck onto me like a beast and a monster of some sort. Lucy! I'm... Do you refer to me as a beast and a monster? No, Mama. G good day. Keep your greatest to yourself. Lucy, you now refer to me as a beast and a monster because I asked you to give my son a child that will take after him, right? I'm sorry. Hello, hello? My daughter-in-law is calling me names because I, I, I told her to stop the children in her womb and give my son king 
a child. We shall see. We shall see to this. Shouting at someone. Who was that? Uju. 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 Which Uju are you talking about? That same Uju. That stupid and useless daughter of my stupid and useless brother. Stop calling him your brother. Huh? Stop calling him your brother. He is not your brother and never be your brother. Oginide. As for that useless girl, Uju, she should thank her stars that I didn't meet her here. I would have cut off her two legs. Nonsense. Diara. I think it's very clear. It is all just they are mad. They are mad. Very crazy. I married you. You see? Because I loved you. I still love you. That is why, despite the fact that we have been married for five years without a child, I still stand by you. Why? Because I love you. It's not my fault that we don't have a penny yet. You had enough reason to insult my mother. No, I, I did not insult your mother. You, you know I will never insult your mother. You know me. You call my mother a monster and a beast. No, I, I, I didn't. You still call her a liar. Oh, gosh. Right before me. No, sweetheart. This is all one. Do I? Still know you. Of course. It's all one big misunderstanding. I swear, there's more to it than I can put into words. It's, it's not how you think it is. I did not mean to come off that way. And I'm sorry. Please. I'm really sorry. This will be the last time, Lucy. So, that my stupid brother, Ozondo, really want to be a clock in the wheel of my progress. How can a man with no child be dragging land with me? Five million naira is a huge amount of money for me to let slip off my hands. I will do everything possible to sell that land. I can't afford to lose the money. No way.
My husband. What are you still doing here all alone? We are supposed to be together in the room by now. What are you doing here? The man whose house is on fire does not go chasing rats. I think I'm confused. We start to lose a whooping sum of money. Five million naira if we lose that land. Hey. So, what do we do? That's exactly what I have been thinking since I came out here. And I am determined to make sure that we do not lose that money. What do you want from a beast and a monster like me? Please leave before you experience the real monster in me. Get out! Please, I am truly very sorry. I, 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 I didn't mean to use those words. I, I'm sorry. Okay, you don't want to leave. Fine, let me leave for you. No, no, please, please, don't be... I'm sorry. I'm truly very sorry. And I swear, you will never hear such words from my mouth. This, this, this will not happen again. So, I am an illiterate. No. I don't understand simple English language. No. Mother, I'm just saying that I didn't mean it the way you understood it. That's... That's all I'm saying. I have heard enough of your insults. Let me go. Mother, please, I'm sorry. I'm truly very sorry. I'm sorry. Yes, Jane, I sent for you. I'm pleased to sit. Thank you. One second, please. You know, uh, forgive my intrusion, but I couldn't help but notice a couple of days ago, you were talking to, I presume, a friend about your cousin's wife who. You know where I'm going with this. Who faked her pregnancy? How did that happen? You don't mind sharing, do you? Yeah, it is um, 100% true, Your Highness. She faked her pregnancy and um, after some time, she claimed she lost it. Her doctor did it for her and um, you know these things work in different stages and ways. So she connected with her doctor, he did it for her. Her tummy was big like um, that of a um, six to eight month pregnant woman. Um, the day she claimed she lost the pregnancy, the blood was so real. It was so real that everyone believed her and felt pity for her. In fact, um, I don't really like talking about the incident because um, it's, it's such an ugly one. Hmm. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry I took you down such sad memory lane. But how did you people find out she, she was lying? Well, she can't lie forever. Her cover blew up because the doctor found out that um, she's married to my cousin, who happened to be his secondary school best friend way back. So that's a bit. Ah. Oh. 
The world is wicked, eh? People are really, really wicked. Is everything all right? You won't understand. Thanks for sharing. It's okay. You can go. brings you to my house this early? Mazi, the issue between my father and his younger brother, Uncle Muzondo, is giving me sleepless nights. I think it might get out of hand, if not properly handled. How old do you mean? <laughs> Mazi, I'm shocked to the one asking this. Can't you see? It is very obvious that they are now serious enemies. <laughs> I don't think it has gotten to that level. It has gotten to that too. Soon, it might go beyond that. Why do you think so? Hmm. Mazi, I was at Uncle Zondo's house yesterday. You needed to see how he looked at me with so much hatred on his face. To the extent that he walked me out of his compound. Hmm. Mazi, you really need to do something very fast. Hmm. Now, what do you want me to do? I want you to call my father to order. Tell him to leave Uncle Uzondo's land alone. And secondly, ask him about Amara's whereabouts. Because Uncle believes that my father knows something about his daughter's disappearance. And you think your father will ever listen to me? Mazi, you are the eldest in the entire family. I strongly believe you can do something. Especially in this ugly situation. Mazi, just please, talk to my father. I think he will listen to you. Please, just talk to him. I've heard you. Yes. I will do my best. Oh no, you know, I... I have not been myself since my secretary told me that story. My king. That is life. We see and we hear a lot of things on daily basis. And those things put together make up what the world is. What do you mean? I think the world is filled with the good, the bad, and the ugly. My king. I believe whatever is believable. Are you saying that the story she told me could be happening to me? You know, my king, this is the first time you are t talking to me concerning your wife in this very doubtful manner. Is there anything you are not telling me? Oh, nothing. Um... Nothing. I'm just... I am just a king who is... scared... and confused. My king... Sorry to be so inquisitive. What is the relationship between you the doctors you've been visiting all this while with your wife. Nothing, no, no relationship whatsoever. As a matter of fact, it's been my wife um, recommending all the doctors that we've been seeing on this matter. You know, I don't have all the time. Well, my king, if your wife has been the one been taking you to the doctors you've been visiting. Their worst fear might turn out to be true. What kind of temptation is this? Oh, 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 oh,
Chimo, 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 chimo